I'm so excited that National History Day State Finals is here. It's one of my favorite times of the year. I want to congratulate the thousands of students across the state of Wisconsin that competed this year. And again, you had to do it in a virtual environment, but you had perseverance and you had stick to and you had a great competitive spirit. The 816 students that moved to regionals this year with 521 projects, great work, outstanding work. Thank you for competing. And then from you, we had moved to 400 students with 99 projects that were incredible that went to state finals. We haven't seen numbers like this in years. So I wanna thank you for your participation. Thank you for your competitiveness, your presentations, and thank you for keeping history alive every day. I also wanna thank your parents. Your parents at home were great coaches. They guided you along the way. They were there for you to answer questions. They were also hopefully keeping you up a little bit longer and giving you some bedtime grace and, you know, and to do your project so you could get it done, as well as being there right beside you and behind you and creating an opportunity for you to complete your projects. I also wanna thank your teachers. Without the teachers, this program could not be possible. Our teachers across the state put in long hours to make these programs possible at schools, and your teachers are coaches and mentors with you all along the way. You know, let's face it, our teachers inspire our kids to build a better future. They create opportunities using history, the lessons of it to create empathy, uh, lessons learned from investigating the past to understand how we got here today and the world that we lived in while it was got created, using history as a tool to understand that one as well. But more importantly, using history to create curiosity and opportunities for people to learn or students so they can become more informed citizens in our society in the future. Now, there's another group of people I need to thank as well. Those are the 255 judges that were with us around the state and at state finals this year, as well as society staff and team members and the foundation uh, staff and team members of the Wisconsin Historical Society. Thank you all for all of your contribu contributions to this year's program. Again, we couldn't have done it without you as well. So now it's time. As you move forward, you are forming as Team Wisconsin. You are representing the great state of Wisconsin at the National History Finals. And I want to say thank you and go Team Wisconsin. I look forward to seeing you after the competition. Good luck. Hello and welcome to the National History Day Wisconsin State Contest Award Ceremony. I am Jessica Schmidt, State Coordinator for NDC in Wisconsin. Thank you for joining us today. On to our category awards. First up, Junior Individual Documentary. Second alternate, 52 Lives Saved, The Role of Diplomacy in the Iran Hostage Crisis. Diana V. Eagle School. First alternate. Ping Pong Diplomacy, Hayden M. Bayview Middle School. National finalists, Stonewall Uprising, A Moment That Changed the World, Phoenix M. Bayview Middle School. What They Taught Us, Corinne B. Kelmerain Middle School. Junior Group Documentary, Second Alternate, White Hope versus Galveston Giant, The Genesis of Athletic Equality, Bethany M. Usara H. and Zara V. University School of Milwaukee. First alternate, The Manhattan Project, The Aftermath, Lauren W. and Peyton D. Bayview Middle School. Our national finalists, Black Sox Scandal, The Fixing That Rocks America's Pastime, Andrea M. and Megan S. Bayview Middle School. Fair Housing in Milwaukee, Progression and Regression, Carson T. and Veer G., University School of Milwaukee. 
Junior individual exhibit, second alternate, Newsies on Strike, Haley M. Bayview Middle School. First alternate, Title IX in Overtime, Equality for Women's College Athletics, Emory P., St. Jude the Apostle. And our national finalists, Giving Madness a Face, Atiano R., University School of Milwaukee, and the Indian Removal Act, Caleb D. Holman Middle School. Junior group exhibit, second alternate, Project Blue Book, more questions and answers, Ayanya A. and Riley F., University School of Milwaukee. First alternate, Fangs Out for Recognition, Gerline A. and Neva M., University School of Milwaukee. And our national finalists, Social Security, Nolan J., Sam M., and Sawyer M., Kettle Moraine Middle School. And the failure in Kyoto, Andy W., and the Kiel L. University School of Milwaukee. Junior paper, second alternate. A meeting of diplomats that changed history, Reed T., University School of Milwaukee. First alternate, the Dow Chemical Protest, the spark that ignited change, Charlie G., St. Jude the Apostle. And our national finalists, the Triangle Factory Fire Guiding Safety Standards for the Workers of America Through Debate and Diplomacy, Paula B. Holman Middle School, and the Protocol that Changed Chemical Warfare, the 1925 Geneva Protocol, John N. University School of Milwaukee. Junior Individual Performance, Second Alternate, Vaccine Diplomacy, and How It Affected the Relationship Between the U.S. and the USSR, Camilla G. Eagle School. First alternate, Newsboy Strike of 1899, Newsflash, Kids Can Make a Difference, Francesca W. Viking Middle School. National finalists are United States versus Susan B. Anthony, Natalie P. Bayview Middle School, and Ludi Stearns, The Difficult Debate and Wise Diplomatic Steps to Strengthen Our democracy by promoting the establishment of libraries across Wisconsin and the nation. Emma M. Kettle Moraine Middle School. Junior group performance, second alternate. The Battle of the Sexes, Ella B. and Maddie W. Jack Young Middle School. First alternate, Ann Putnam Witch Trials, Liv T., Lauren H., and Sarah G. Richfield Middle School. And our national finalists, Title IX, Charlie C. and Macy K. Holman Middle School, and Esther Peterson and the Equal Pay Act of 1963, Esme S. and Kirith G. Eagle School. Junior Individual Website, Second Alternate, Trying to Drive Through the Defense, The Debate Over Women's Basketball, Anisha J. University School of Milwaukee. First Alternate, Wilma Mankiller, Cherokee Values in Debate and Diplomacy, Liza K. Homeschool. And our national finalists, the Outer Space Treaty, RTD2, Reinforcing Reproachment with Debate and Diplomacy, Raghav T. Holman Middle School, and the Sabin Polio Vaccine, Advancement Between Adversaries, Nina G. University School of Milwaukee. Junior Group Website, Second Alternate, Japanese American Internment Camps, Josiah Z. and Maddox F. Holman Middle School. First Alternate, the Equal Rights Amendment, Debate and Diplomacy for Equal Rights, Julia L., Layla P., and Presley Z., Jack Young Middle School. And our national finalists, our best soldiers, Aurelia D. and Caitlin P., University School of Milwaukee, and Mendez versus Westminster, Unspoken but Not Unheard, Delia N. and Liesl K., University School of Milwaukee. And to our senior categories, Senior Individual Documentary, Second Alternate. France hosts both debate and diplomacy during World War II, Emma P., Wisconsin Heights High School. First Alternate, The Wisconsin Walleye War, Through Debate and Diplomacy, Madison O., West Salem High School. And our national finalists, 
Ping Pong Diplomacy, Naya H, DC Everest ID School, and The Suez Canal Crisis, How Debate and Diplomacy Led to Resolution, Noah S, DC Everest Idea School. Senior Group Documentaries, Second Alternate, Loving v. Virginia, Debating the Forbidden Love of Interracial Couples, Ella T and Paige M, Germantown High School. First Alternate, The Clean Water Act, Cassandra U, Cecilia Z, Gail W, and Isaiah K, Green Bay Southwest High School. And our national finalists, The Love Canal Disaster, A Dose of Toxicology, Elena W, and Megan G, Germantown High School. And The Lavender Scare, Desiree V, and Presley K, Green Bay Southwest High School. Senior Individual Exhibit, Second Alternate, The Amazing Comic Book Adventures, Censorship, Kyla S, Elva Strum, School District. First Alternate, The Climate Debate, Miriam J, Cedarburg High School. And our national finalists, Louisiana Purchase, Isley T, Bangor High School, and Debating Primary Elections, Robert M. LaFollette's Fight Against Government Corruption, Anna S. Madison West High School. Senior Group Exhibit, Second Alternate. Freedom's Fight for Freedom, Proposing Fundamental Opportunities Through Diplomatic Efforts, Addison J., Devin T., Paige E., and Tessa C., Manitowoc Lincoln High School. First Alternate, The 19th Amendment, Suffrage Wins, Delaney D., Katie H., and Veronica K., Cedarburg High School. And our national finalists, Damn It, Bri Brianna M., Delaney K., Ella B., and Jennifer W., Green Bay Southwest High School, and the Great Lakes Fishery Commission, a Success of Diplomacy, Felicity C., and Violet B., Wisconsin Heights High School. Senior paper, second alternate, Debate and Diplomacy and the consequence to, and Consequences, the Southwestern Expansion of the United States, Aharon S. Madison West High School. First alternate, the Iran-Contra Affair, Debate over Covert Diplomacy, Alan K. Homeschool. And our national finalists, Debate and Diplomacy Surrounding the Use of the Atomic Bomb Technology as a Military War Tactic to End World War II, Anna R. Williams Bay High School, and the Iwakura Mission of 1871, a Diplomatic Odyssey, August N. Marquette University High School. Our senior individual performance national finalists, Diplomacy Following Disaster, the Aftermath of the Sterling Hall Bombing, Megan F. Madison West High School, and Brown v. Board of Education, the debate for and against school desegregation, Page J. Germantown High School. And senior group performance national finalists, the Christmas Truce of 1914, Caden P., Emily C., Ken R., and Kinsey P., Prescott School District. Senior individual website, second alternate. Radium Girls, Sparking Debate in the Workplace, Jane T., Germantown High School. First alternate, the televised, first televised presidential debate, Allison R., Green Bay Southwest High School. And our national finalists, Camp Manzanar, The Destruction of Foreign Numbers, Nora M. New Richmond High School, and Victorian Dress Reform, The First Steps Towards Feminism, Madeline K. Anthony Akers Charter School. Senior group website, second alternate, The Lavender Scare, Colin P., Grace W., and Sabrina B., Cedarburg High School. First alternate, Katherine Johnson, Addie B., Leah C., and Lizzie G., Germantown High School. And our national finalists, the 1791 debate on the National Bank, Braden B., Brett D., and Darren D., Green Bay Southwest High School, and the Berlin Airlift, Natalie F., and Rhiannon A., Cedarburg High School. That concludes our category awards. On to our special awards. First up, the American Labor History Award presented by the Wisconsin Society for Labor History is awarded to 
The Kohler strike of 1934, the result of failed diplomacy, Brett D, Levi H, and Keeler S, and Newsboy strike of 1899, Newsflash, Kids Can Make a Difference, Francesca W. The Outstanding Archival Research Award is presented by Carol Heidemann and is given to Panama Canal, One Ditch Uniting Two Nations, Ayush K, and How Iran Held America Hostage, Nina R, and Ellen Z. The Chronicling America Award, presented by the Wisconsin National Digital Newspaper Program, is awarded to Debate and Diplomacy in the Nazi Olympics, April H. The Civil Rights History Award, presented by the Wisconsin Council for Social Studies, is presented to the Black Panther Party Igniting the Debate over Police Brutality, Esther O, and the Debate and Diplomacy with Ojibwe Spearfishing Rights, Mackenzie K. The Early American History Award, presented by the Wisconsin Society of Mayflower Descendants, is awarded to the Was Salem Witch Trials, How One Debate Single-Handedly Killed Hundreds, Juno H., and Debate and Diplomacy Consequences, the Southwestern Expansion of the United States, Aharon S. The Environmental History Award is presented by Dr. and Mrs. Ralph Kurtzman, and is awarded to the Trans-Alaska Pipeline, Sagel Rose S, and the Wisconsin Walleye War through Debate and Diplomacy, Madison O. Geography Award is presented by the Wisconsin Geographic Alliance and is awarded to an oasis of peace in a desert of war, the enduring legacy of the Camp David Accords, ANG and Ishan B, and the Treaty of Versailles, a diplomatic failure, Anna W. and Tyler W. The Local History Award is presented by the Wisconsin Council for Local History and is awarded to the One Buck Bill Regulating Wisconsin's Deer Population, Brianna D., and the Bayview Massacre, Maddie K. The Maritime History Award Junior Division is presented by the National Maritime History Historical Society and is presented to the Cuban Missile Crisis, a moment humanity was almost destroyed, Amelia E. and Alyssa K., and a meeting of diplomats that changed history, Reed T. The senior division, also presented by the National Maritime Historical Society, is presented to the Gulf of Tonkin, Shooting at Wales, Brett G. and Brady N., and the Clean Water Act, Cassandra U., Cecilia Z., Gail W., and Isaiah K. The Wisconsin History Award is presented by the John T. Gilfos Endowment and is awarded to the Dow Chemical Protest, the spark that ignited change, Charlie S. and the Gaylord Nelson, Diplomat of the Earth, Lily S. The Women in History Award is presented by the Friends of the Wisconsin Historical Society and is given to Wilma Mankiller, Cherokee Values and Debate and Diplomacy, Liza K., and the 19th Amendment, Suffrage Wins, Delaney D., Katie H., and Veronica K. The Equality and History Award and the Transnational Global History Award are both currently in the process of being judged and the winners will be contacted via email. If you are moving on to the national contest, you will receive an email next week with further instructions about next steps. And next week, all of the project evaluations will be available for all contestants. Congratulations, and thank you so much to all of our participants for all your hard work. You should be so proud of everything you have accomplished with the project you have created. Thank you so much for the support of our program sponsors and our special award sponsors for believing in the work of NHG and making it possible with your gifts. We also want to say a big thank you to all of the teachers and parents for all your hard work this season. Thank you for supporting your NHC students on their journey this season. Thank you also to all of our volunteers who have helped with judging. You make NHC such a special experience with the gift of your time. And finally, thank you to the staff at the Wisconsin Historical Society and the Wisconsin Historical Foundation who support the work of NHC and make it possible. Good luck to Team Wisconsin at Nationals. We are rooting for you.